Today we're reviewing Velveeta Shells and Cheese Bites. The shells are right inside the crust. Boy, they didn't rip off the BK Cheetos thing at all. Two videos in a week. That is a recent record. Do you know what we're reviewing? Yeah, Velveeta Cheese Shells Bites. Close enough. Velveeta Shells and Cheese Bites, as seen in the open. I'm Greg, he's Q, together we're Mr. Happy 0121. We eat something, we tell you what we think about it. Occasionally we give you input. Sometimes we don't. Sometimes we just give you a score and it drives the internet crazy. Because really, we just don't like, we go, oh, well, I kind of liked it. And people go, that's not a food review. <laughs> so you'll have to watch the rest of the video to see what we're going to do today. Now, before we dig right in, because we went ahead and cooked these at 425 degrees in an oven for six to seven minutes, we followed directions. My understanding when you see the box is that they're going to come out in one piece like a chicken nugget. Nope. But when they show them on the plate and they kind of show it on the front, it's broke open. The reason for that is, yeah, if you try to pick one of these up, it's going to completely fall apart. That's why we have forks. Are you ready to try bite one? Yeah. Go try it without the fork. Bite one. It's hard to get a close-up. Like, the actual... It looks like somebody bit into shells and cheese. It's just brown. You can't really like differentiate anything at all. Bite two. Third and final bite. 15 of these in a box, $5 a box. So you're paying, uh, I don't know, let's do some math. You're paying about a quarter a piece for each one of these. So you're paying in the neighborhood of 25 cents a piece off the top of my head for these. So every time you eat one of these, you're eating a quarter. Yeah, that's about right. Four is a dollar. There's 15. About a quarter a piece. I don't know. That kind of takes away from the appeal of every time I eat one of these, it's a quarter. So we'll take away the value. I think it's $3.98, superior value to $5. And I bought these for $5 at Walmart. You know everything's cheap at Walmart, so it may be more expensive other places. Take the value off the table. The actual product itself is okay. I like the texture. Texture is good. You get the crunch from the outside, then you get the chewy on the inside with the shells. The cheese flavor didn't overwhelm me. This would be good as a side. Two or three on a side with something else. But as a snack on a plate, no. 78. What says you? 82. I agree with everything you're saying. I think this would be a lot better if like the taste of the cheese was more uh, pronounced, I guess. It was, it was like more there. Very more, muted. Yeah, very muted. It's just not a very strong taste. So, I think it would be like an 88 if it had like a stronger cheese taste. But besides that, it's pretty darn good. If you were eating these, because you know, you kind of agreed with what I said. So let's see. Let's see your magic. Throw something in for us. Would you dip these in anything? And what would you do? Uh, ranch. Ranch. Hmm. See, and I don't even like ketchup that much. I, I almost think I might try ketchup. A horseradish. Something like for that. reals. Really? I've never known you to eat horseradish. Oh, I love horseradish. He loves all kinds of things I don't know about. That's why I never check his search history. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. I got This <laughs> is funny. Got to pop out of him. It, it happens. Pop out of me. Happens once in a while. We're off to go uh, look at some Twitch for a moment because we're kind of kicking around the idea of going over there. But unlike most disgruntled YouTubers, we're not going to go over there and beg for money. We just want to go somewhere where we can say things that would get us kicked off of YouTube. We're still going to be here. We're just going to be 37% less edgy. Stay vigilant. Mr. Happy, 0121. We do have a Twitch. You can find us on there under that. But we're not doing anything there. But you can find us there. You can add that to the uh, growing roster. The Instagram, the Snapchat, and the Facebook. Until next time, friends. Stay vigilant. Two in one show. Happy trails. Oh, can I can't sing happy trails because probably copyrighted. No, I think that dude's a hundred years old and dead. Rip him. They used to have this uh, multimedia store named Hastings, <laughs> and when it was time for you to get the hell out, they would start playing happy trails on loop for about the last fifteen minutes you were supposed to be in the store. Really? Yeah. When you heard happy trails, that was their way of saying out of the store. <laughs> so. Happy trails to you.